March Madness is officially upon us here in the first round of the Women's NCAA Tournament. I'm Luke Baker. And I'm Kayla Pace. We're here at Colonial Life Arena where the number one seed Lady Gamecocks are taking on the number 16 UNC Asheville Bulldogs. The Gamecocks dominated throughout the game after a slow start in the first quarter. Luke, what did you think? Well, I think uh, obviously the Gamecocks uh, were dominant, winning 90 to 40. Um, I think the uh, there was a little trouble in the beginning uh, at first because it was a close game, uh, about uh, 15 to 11 at one point. I believe uh, you know the the USC Asheville Bulldogs were definitely um, you know keeping up with them on their fast breaks, but I think they were able to um, find their groove later in the in the second quarter, especially with those uh, key players on the Gamecocks team. Yes, um, Asia Wilson uh, scored 18 points today, as did Bianca Cuevas Moore, and um, there was a standout performance from Alicia Gray, um, who put up 22 points. And I think she was key in switching the um, outcome of the game around because uh, she had a lot of fast breaks mm -hmm. going the other way. Yeah, yes, definitely. And um, of course, um, the Gamecock, you know, the Gamecocks definitely look like a one scene out there uh, today. Uh, you know. Handing, handling with ease and even putting in their uh, uh, second string in in the fourth quarter. So that shows that you know they had a pretty strong control out there. And, and Don Saley definitely wasn't uh, up there yelling. She was pretty uh, composed on the uh, the bench there. So yeah, I found it super impressive how Alicia Gray managed to put up her first double double despite the fact that most of the players that were in at the end of the game were all off the bench. Yeah, definitely. It was uh, it was a great great game for her and. Um, you know, going into the second round, I think uh, uh, Gamecocks have a, a, a pretty good uh, shot of uh, winning the next game. It was great getting back uh, out on the court, you know, after being off for a few weeks. Um, I thought our players really uh, uh, locked into the game plan and um, executed on both sides of the ball. It's probably more in response to the game situation. I, I just thought that we needed to change how we were playing um, ball screens in particular, and, and also just the pace of it. We need to create some some offense from our defense, and the, the best way you do that is, is to speed the game up and press a little bit. The Gamecocks are back in action this Sunday, March 19th, in the second round against number eight, Arizona State. Stay tuned for more coverage on the NCAA tournament. For Capital City Sports, I'm Luke Baker. And I'm Kayla Pace.